All right, boys, time for some trick shots. This one I call bouncing off the wall. Simple. Stand under the goal like this. Oh, never mind. I don't think this is a good one. All right, let's get this next one. This one I call running blind. Start the video over again. I'm just gonna do it again and edit the other part out. Run blind. Oh wow, that was second try, surprisingly. This one I'm gonna call Blind Billy. Simple. All I have to do start with my eyes closed, about right here, and then just walk around in circles, get myself disorientated. I'm almost there. No, I think that's the direction of the goal. I promise I'm not looking. Oh, wow. I can't believe I actually made that. This one I call Tree Jubilee. Simply put, I'm going to climb this tree and shoot it from there. I don't know if I can actually climb this to the back of my arm. You know what? I'm just going to jump up onto the tree and shoot it. Tree Jubilee, baby. <laughs> hey, that was on target. I just said too much pepper. I call this behind the goal savagery. I call this Bounce past 360. What's going on, guys? Uh, it's the next day. I decided to start over and do a different video today, so have fun with some awesome trick shots today. I call this bouncing to the moon. I call this fire the cannon. <laughs> I call this firing the I gave up on trick shots after trying to fling a ball in with this snow scooper like 20 times. So for the rest of the video, I'll just use old footage of me uh, revealing my exclusive Lego. What's going on, Easy Gang? It is a beautiful, well, it's actually kind of a dreary day. Yeah. I'm not supposed to mow a yard yesterday and it started raining, so that made me mad. Anyways, I was listening to Griffin's podcast, as one does when they want fire content. And Lego Ninjago came up, and I realized how much Legos I have. Throw on that drawer, though, I gotta dig them out. I'm going to do a little in-depth. I've already got some of them. I'm going to do an in-depth look at some of my, uh, of my collection, and then I'm going to try to draw some of them. So uh, let me get all these guys out, and then let's get into it. Well, here they all are in a massive pile, and this is my messy desk. Pretty cool. Get all my stuff up there. Yeah, I probably should clean my room, but anyways. Uh, oh, what was I going to say? I'm going to put them all into categories of, like, fandom and like different like things and go over the ones that i like the best and dude i used to have humongous bins of legos but i've lost a lot of them we put some of them up giving some of them away so i wish i had all the weapons that go with them but sadly haven't played with legos in quite some time so i've lost some of the stuff but let's get into it uh here they are line them up the best i could now let's go over the different thingies so i have my snakes and like that weird monster thingy over there these are all pretty cool not much to say on them just i was kind of into the snakes me and my neighborhood used to trade lego minifigs so that's how i got some of these those are some other snakes and then all my ninja right here i got the that version of kai and then jay oh i forgot the green one's name i didn't really like him uh cole all of those guys and the white one i think zane or something i never really liked him that much either anyways Here's some like DC and Marvel guys like Captain America, Mandalorian, ooh, Star-Lord. 
And then Davy Jones over here, man, this guy's worth a lot of money now, I would think. Last time I checked, he was at like 50 bucks, but he was a pretty cool guy. I got a nice trade for him. Ooh, there's one of the staffs. Forgot to put that in that guy's hand, but whatever. Now, here we got a first edition Darth Maul. First one to ever come out. Palpatine, pretty creepy. All these clone troopers. Boba Fett. Some guys from the Lego movie. More clone troopers. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. If I had to pick a favorite... Hmm. Boba Fett, probably. Uh, yeah, so there they all are. And I used to have awesome sets, but for some reason when I was a kid, they all got destroyed. But I still kept this one intact, the slave one, baby. And it even fires this little thingy out. Bee! Oh, so that's kind of cool. Probably my favorite set. And then I have another Boba Fett that goes in there. Surprised this one stayed intact for so long. Anyways, let's try to draw some of them.